Hey guys, welcome back to Groovy Post. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to add friends on Steam. This will be great if you wanna play games with your friends or if you wanna see their status to see if your friend is on a game, is available, or is offline. Now to do this, I had to use two Steam accounts in order to friend each other because it'd be kind of pointless if I showed you how to friend yourself, which I think would be kind of borderline stupid. But anyway, let's go ahead and figure this out. So. What you wanna do is hover over your profile like this on the web version or the app version and go down to friends. And I'm gonna be doing this twice. That way I can get both profiles to do the same thing. Now you're on your friends page. You'll see Toysted, which is my personal account, already has a good amount of friends, but Groovy Post doesn't have any friends yet. So let's go ahead and make that change. We're gonna to go to add a friend. So this is where the magic happens. We have three ways we can add a friend on Steam. We can either send them our friend code, we can send them a quick invite link, or we can try searching for their profile name. So I'm gonna be showing you each way we can be doing this. So I'm gonna pretend that Guru Post is us and Toystud is the person we're trying to friend. What we do is we copy our code and we send it to them. So once you send it to them, they will then paste it into enter a friend code. So I'm gonna right click, hit paste, and then there's Groovy Post. Once Groovy Post pops up, we can click send invite. Now, let's say Toy Stud doesn't wanna use your friend code. There's another way he can do it. He can come down to searching for your profile name, type in Groovy Post, and then hit enter or the search button, there's Groovy Post. Then we'll hit add as friend, and it'll tell you that you sent the invite. Click the back button. Now that we've done all that, Toysted has sent the invite through the code and through searching for the profile name. For Groovy Post, sometimes you'll get a little notification number here letting you know you got a pending invite. I'm just gonna click on pending invites to see if we got any invites, because sometimes it won't show you if you got a pending invite. Oh, there you go. We're gonna click accept, and now we should be friends. If we go to your friends on our Groovy Post profile, there's Toy Stud. Now, what's great about this is now we can see that Toy Stud is offline. We can see that right here. Now we're online, but if we don't want other people to see that we're online, or we wanna say, hey, we're busy, there's many ways we can do that. On the Steam app, it's a bit easier to show you this than on the Steam web app. So I'm gonna show you how to do it on Toystud. So on Toystud, now that I've showed you how to make friends on Steam, I'm gonna be showing you how to utilize being friends with people on Steam. What you do is you go to this friends icon on the very top. It's above here. Click on that and then go to view friends list. Now, once you do that, you'll get a little pop-up like this here. It'll show you all your friends and much more. It'll also tell you what friends are in a group chat, if you have any chats. And if you wanna chat with someone, such as this person right here, I can double click on their name and I can say hello. I just sent a chat to them. What's even greater though, is I can say what I want my status to be. I can be online. I can disable or enable, do not disturb. You'll see a little red icon here that will let you know if the person doesn't wanna be disturbed. You can go away. You can go invisible, which basically shows all your friends that you're offline. However, you could actually be online without them knowing. And that's basically it. That's all there is to being friends on Steam. If you guys found this video helpful, please like and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments section. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.